Welcome back to Eurosport Cycling. My name's Josh Carlson, and we're going to continue our build today on our brand new Canyon Strive. We've got a bunch of bouncy bits in the front and the rear today, and we're going to walk you through some suspension jargon to understand what's what, where it goes, and how to set it up. The front suspension of our brand new mountain bike has 180 millimeters of suspension travel, which controls how far your front wheel goes up and down from the ground. On the left hand side, we have an air spring chamber. This is where you adjust your air pressure to set the ride height of your fork. On the right hand side, we have low speed and high speed compression tuning, which as the name dictates, low speed, low speed compression. High speed, the faster you go, high speed compression. At the other end of the fork down the bottom here, we have low and high speed rebound adjustment. This controls how quickly your fork resets after impact. We've got a 15 millimeter front axle, which keeps our front end stiff and has plenty of traction up front. As we come around the back of our fork, we have some bleed chambers. What this does, these chambers of our lower fork, they get excess air built up in them as we're riding. So we give these little nipples here a bit of a psh -psh that releases that air, frees up the fork, allows us to continue on with the ride. From our front to the back, we have our rear suspension. It is also air sprung, which has a chamber which you fill with air to set your ride height of this rear shock. We have low and high speed compression, similar to our fork. We also have low and high speed rebound, which is also similar to our fork. One little feature that you can see on our rear shock is this little rubber band that slides up and down the shaft. You'll notice on the fork here, there is one as well. What these little rubber band features do is they assist you in setting your suspension sag. Your suspension sag is a key element in setting up your mountain bike and it provides fantastic intel for the performance and stability of your front and rear suspension. We'll show you how to set this up later in the series. Follow along all the action from the home of cycling on Eurosport Cycling, Instagram, YouTube, and TikTok, and we will see you trackside.